I have cherished a hope that I might leave such a character as those who might believe in my testimony after I should be called hence. I have been sensitive on this subject, so you would be under the circumstances, had you stood in the presence of John, thou departed brother Joseph to receive the lesser priesthood, and in the presence of Peter, to receive the greater, and looked down through time and witnessed the effects these two must produce. You would feel what you have never felt, where wicked men conspiring to lessen the effects of your testimony on man, after you should have gone to your long-sought rest. One evening, when, after having done her usual day's work in the house, grandmother went to the barn to milk the cows, she met a stranger carrying something on his back that looked like a knapsack. At first, she was a little afraid of him, but when he spoke to her in a kind, friendly tone, and began to explain to her the nature of the work which was going on in her house, she was filled with inexpressible joy and satisfaction. He then untied his knapsack and showed her a bundle of plates. He turned the leaves over, leaf after leaf, and also showed her the engravings upon them, after which he told her to be patient and faithful in bearing her burden a little longer, promising that if she would do so, she should be blessed. David, it's good to see you, my friend. What brings you to my home home? Sir Lonathan, thank you for seeing me. Of course, it's a pleasure. I'm, I'm wondering if you might send a document for me. It vouches for my honor and integrity. We, the undersigned citizens of Richmond, Ray County, Missouri, where David Whitmer has resided since the year 1838, certify that we have been long and intimately acquainted. We know him to be a man of the highest integrity and of undoubted truth and veracity. Two judges, attorneys, the county clerk and treasurer, various merchants. Well, Dr. Mosby and even the postmaster, there are 20 men here. Is there a spot at the top for you? So you did. I know few men with more honor and integrity. Now, now, please sit down and tell me what this is all about. We'll be the ones telling you what to do. Oh, you want this to end? Just tell us it was all a lie. What was a lie? That book, that Mormon Bible. How can you deny what I know to be Oh, now what do you think of your God when he don't save you? I think you can kill me, but I want you to know that you can kill me. Seems likely you're right. Let's get him out. 